Welcome back to this Let's Play of The Last Remnant. Last time we started on, on Base 2, and uh, here's the boss for Base 2. These are kind of formulaic areas. Um, the bosses, at least, are different. Me is... Sweeto, helper to Mr. Conqueror. Me is gonna... kill you. Ah, scary. Here is too scary. You guys is... scary. You, you, you all's gonna bite it right here. They don't call me the flesh render for nothing. Get it, bro? I ain't scared of nothing. Yeah, because we's all going to the same place anyhow. The other side ain't no bad idea. How's about we all find out? Hmm. A little bit of multiple personality issues there. Hmm. I was thinking, you know, maybe finally someone's finally going to respect you for, you know, trashing the world, but guess not. And he has his usual group, you know, legion of stuff, so. I'm going to try actually having my party uh, split up rather than all focus on the same one. Usually that's... I mean, I, I'm, I want to make sure I kill things, but I also don't want to have them attack Zuido directly unless they actually have... you know, until we're done with everything else. And I'm confident enough that even Split Up will be able to uh, deal with these guys. Though we still ended up with a lot of people attacking the boss instead of you know, attacking enemies that are actually going to die in the short term. And with flanking attacks and everything, we'll pay for it, so... And Giant Press is his, uh, his bonus attack, and he doesn't do it every turn, but... We are making more progress here, but this is not one of the fights. There's, I think actually there's only one of the fights where it's worthwhile to actually sort of split up um, and just, well, not split up, but go straight for the boss. And that's not going to be... I think that's technically the next base in the order uh, for the, uh, you know, if we were actually doing the bases in order. 
but I'm not going to do them in that order because it doesn't drop anything I actually care about. Oh, hey, he actually, I was expecting him to do a giant press that turn and kill a bunch of people, but I guess not. This must be this turn must be, be the giant press turn. Which means I don't want to deadlock everyone with it. Cyclone is just a, a weapon art. Hyper hammer, I'm not sure he is though. Yeah, I think it is. Anyway. I'll have Rush charge in with uh, with Omni Strike, and everybody else will break out and heal up. Cool. Good shot. Ironically, Arena does more damage than Rush does without attack. Since everybody's at full health, they're reassessing to uh, go to But I'm okay with that. Giant Press wasn't that bad anyways. There are... Zuido, I think, is probably actually the easiest of the uh, six base fights. The hardest one is probably Hannah and Hannah, but Nolten can recover the pain too. Not that Zuido's a total pushover, but I think you can see that he's not not as challenging as the others. Alright, so Rush's group is going to defend. I'm going to have my other melee groups split out and uh, heal. And I'm going to see if we can try and keep people on the sides. With Miracle up, he's probably going to one-shot my unions fairly often, which is why I had Rush defend. Defending increases your, your dodge chance as well as just the defense.
Cyclone is kind of messed up. I think it, there's supposed to be an animation where it sort of hits you and then comes back. So sometimes it just sort of hangs here for a while. It's one of the few sort of outright bugs that uh, persists in the game. And fortunately, it, they, you know, set it up so that it, it times out and eventually it just gives up on trying to do it, show the rest of the animation. So it's not really a game-breaking bug, it's just... quirky. Huh? What's the deal? This... this ain't fun at all. It's cold. Cold, cold, cold. Damn it! Cold, cold, cold. Somebody... do something. Do... Cold. Sweet! Yeah! That means nothing to me. I feel stronger than before! I feel like I've grown. This thing, huh? And, uh, he drops the obsidian, which is a, so a uh, sword. Rush can't use it, so you might as well give it to, uh, Gal. And it's part of the reason that Gao is a good character, is that he gets to use one of these special weapons. But, uh... I miss the plus two, but oh well. Um... And people want random stuff. But, uh... We'll go talk to the Duke of Gore again, and see if he has anything to say. Now that we've cleared two bases... Nope, not yet. Well, next time we're gonna go and complete that outside fight for yet another base.